show them what we got. Dun dun dun. The Tragical Express. 3.55 tomorrow. We get on the bus. Our life ends. Also, I feel like a pile of poop this morning. Someone is ill. Mm -hmm. I will spare you the details because believe me, you don't. They don't want to know any of these stuff, do they? <laughs> I just, uh, yeah, it's been a little bit of a rough morning. Um, it is 10.55 and we are still in our room if that doesn't yeah, tell you wait. something. Uh, someone had to make a target run. Yeah. Uh, the good part about that is that I am drinking Diet Mountain Dew right now, which makes me very happy. I tried the lift. <clears throat> yeah. That was super easy. Pay right there, you tip on the app and... Shows you when the guy's coming, what his name is, the car he's driving. So he pulls right up, takes you to Target, and that's it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, took one back, back here. Takes you to Target. That's the only place Lyft goes is Target. Had a coupon for the first one, so the first one was free. First ride. Yeah, free. that's nice. And then Target to here, out of animation, and Target on Earl Bronson was uh, like eleven eighty or something like that. And then yeah. I added a tip, so. That's not bad. Not bad if you gotta go in a hurt, you know, quick. Yep. Probably gonna be very slow paced today, cause, yeah. This trip has, uh, this trip has taken it out of me. Wipe dropped. That's usual though. That is usual. I am usually pretty wiped by the last day. Actually, last trip in December, I mean, I was weird, I was just re-watching that footage the other day at home from that, um, our third vlog from our last trip and first of all I had a laughing attack because of the grandpa sweater incident <laughs> but <laughs> if you want to know what that is you'll have to go find our <clears throat> our last Disney vlog from the last trip but I, I was in a mood that morning I didn't even want to go I was tired and and it was I don't know I just I, I wasn't that excited about Animal Kingdom and I didn't want to go but that ended up being the trip where I tried Flight of Passage and Everest for the first time so it ended yeah. up being really good and that was going to be our short day too and then somebody accidentally stumbled upon a second flight of passage fast pass and we ended up there yeah. till nighttime but and then we ran around disney springs like crazy people all night well <laughs> so luckily this, it should be too late even if we stay till late it's only it's, it's park closes at 8 30 yeah so and star wars things at nine which is weird yeah, we still don't know how that all works, but, but it, any which way, it won't be yeah, as late be as it would be at the other parks, so we'll see how it all goes. How we're all, how, well, you're always feeling fine, huh? I kind of hate him that he's always feeling fine. I feel like a butt, but that's okay. Sometimes you feel like a butt. <laughs> Poor unfortunate soul. And instantly, when I said sometimes you feel like a butt, I wanted to launch into the Almond Joy Mouse yeah. song. <laughs> sometimes you don't. <laughs> but then, well, sometimes, sometimes you don't. You feel like a nut. <laughs> but then, if you finish that song, it's Almond Joy's got butts. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, things are getting a little bit. Tough. Today's today's vlog might be a little silly. Could be crazy.
outside of the Sci-Fi Dine-In right now waiting for our reservation time. It is hot and humid and crazy here today. There's a decent breeze. We might have just bought our first annual pass holder merchandise. You might have to wait to see it until our haul. We'll see, but um, people are looking at me like I'm weird, so that's all you're gonna get for right now. Movies. We're having a turkey sandwich and a cheeseburger and some shakes. Mm. Alright, we're sitting on the other side now. Outside, outside of Sci-Fi. Sci just, just finished our lunch. It was delicious. Delicious. Oh, turkey sandwich. Mm, I had a burger again. Same as last time. Shake. Yep. I had a strawberry. You had vanilla. So good. <clears throat> um, now we're trying to decide where to go next. Who did we see working in the baseline Steve Porter working on some video. It's been a Steve Porter kind of trip. <laughs> Something outside. <laughs> oh, funny. Uh, he's from the Diz Unplugged, if nobody knows who he is. Or the Diz, I guess. Um, yeah, we're trying to decide where to go next. We have a 255 Fast Pass for Slinky Dog. So, I don't know if we should just head in the direction of Toy Story Land and kind of mill around there. We didn't hang out there a whole lot last time because it was so busy. It's going to be busier this time even, but... Oh, uh, it looks like it's... Uh, I don't see the storms. No, the sun's coming back out, which is unfortunate. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it is kind of unfortunate today because it's hot. It's... I don't know what the temperature is right now, but the high is like 87 or 88, so... And it's very humid. So, not amazing, but... That's all right. It's been mostly in a good weather trip. Yeah. Yesterday was hot too, but it wasn't. It wasn't hot. It was just warm, out and the sun was beating down on us. But feels like 84 right now. 80. It's 80. It feels like. 80. I would say it feels warmer than 84, wouldn't you? And not till 7 p.m. There's a 30% chance. Actually, with the breeze coming through, 84 is probably pretty spot on. But when that breeze quits moving, it gets really warm. Probably cloudy the next couple hours. Yeah. You can't trust that weather. Yeah. I mean, I see mostly. We haven't. There hasn't been a single storm, and there was lightning, lightning bolts in the whole forecast. No, it's so. 7 p.m. There's 30% chance. That's it. Yeah. Weird. And then what's tomorrow? Nothing on the radar. Tell the camera what tomorrow is. It's a stupid. That's just my mouth. It's a stupid day. It's a travel home day. Man. <laughs> It'll be one of those things where you're so tired when you get home. I feel like that getting home, like being home is nice. It's a no place like home kind of feeling, but then by the next day it's worn off and you wish you were back here. How do you think? Yeah, it's good to be home. Oh, not to <coughs> get there and go back to work first.
Hollywood Studios? It is. No, I'm not. It's the Yacht Club. It was so hot. We went on Slinky Dog, which was awesome. We love Slinky Dog. And then just getting out of Toy Story Land, I, I felt like, seriously, like I was in a pile of boiling water. That was hot. It was bad. That, you know, right after that, the clouds moved in. Of course. But it doesn't look like it's going to rain like they said it was going to, and it's just, it's too, it's too hot. So, we are, we took a lift again, um, and this woman was awesome, she was super chatty. She took us, uh, took us a little detour so we could see the back of the new Ratatouille ride, and yeah. 
she was fun. She was talking about the Halloween yeah. party and she yeah. worked here before. So. Yeah, it was really nice. The other, well, the two guys who picked him up for Target this morning and the guy who picked us up this morning, they didn't say a single word except for yeah. bye, goodbye, thank you. <laughs> this one was really nice. And we just got, I got a monster and he got a, a lemonade. And then I got a Mickey Rice Krispie treat and he got a big chocolate chip cookie. Was that good? Yeah. Yeah. We're chilling in the little um, the market at Ale and Compass. It's a little quick service area at the Yacht Club. Now we're going to go sit in the lobby for a little bit. Because, you know, we like to sit in the lobby and pretend we belong at the deluxe resorts. <laughs> And we'll wander a little bit probably. We'll probably go over to Beach Club. If it gets unexpectedly nice out for some reason, we can go sit on the boardwalk. Otherwise, I think the plan is to go have dinner at our resort uh, later tonight, right? Maybe some more of those ridiculously delicious chicken nuggets. Anyway, we're going to go sit in the Yacht Club and... Pre oh, do you, do you have your voice ready? The Yacht Club. Yeah, we have to, we have to act like that over here. Hi. 1990 we were built, okay? 1990. 1990, okay. All these here, and then we just had our, over our 25th uh, anniversary. And awesome. At Christmas, there's a tree that goes like an inch away from that. I've outlet. seen that. Yeah. So I've seen good. that. Yeah, so you've seen that. Right? Yes. That was awesome. They were built in 1990. So, as the gentleman just told us, pretty cool. We're sitting at the beach club now. We just like to go sit and pretend like we're staying at the fancy ones. These two, well, Yacht Club is definitely our favorite, like the decor and all of that, but these two in Boardwalk, because of their location probably, are our three favorite deluxe or anything. Because of that, yeah. for sure. The Yacht Club might be my favorite overall, for all the other reasons. I mean, go in the Boardwalk lobby. It's pretty small. Though. It's pretty small, yeah. The boardwalk isn't quite as cool that way. Like the rooms are probably awesome and everything, but the rest of it, because the outside is their, that's their quick service, that's their store. You know, they don't have any of that inside. Um, and I love the monorail resorts, but they're so crowded. This one's busy today too, but those ones are always crowded. So it's not quite as relaxing. I'm a little bit sad that we didn't get to the poly on this trip, but we'll get there on the next trip. Really? Well, maybe we won't care next trip because we'll be at our own deluxe resort next trip. Yeah. We'll be at Old Key West. Maybe every vlog that trip is just going to be us in our room because we're going to love it so much that we're never going to leave. Oh, except there's this little thing called Galaxy Edge opening. Yeah. And the Halloween party. And the Halloween party. Which now, after talking to the Lyft driver, I feel like we need costumes. We're waiting for a minivan. Oh, I think it's right there. 42. I think that's it. Closing out our final Disney day. Oh. I know. There's a pizza box here, sorry. Pizza. I thought we'd sit at our table here. Um, we're both freshly showered, that's why we look like this. We have all of our bags put together. We are ready to go, except we have a few odds and ends to put in our carry-on bags, and we need to go through our souvenirs, which we'll show you the little pile in a second. But um, yeah, we've got our boarding passes. We're all checked in. So all we need to do is tomorrow morning, anytime after 5 a.m., up to three hours before your flight, which we're going to the airport before then, so. No. Um, we need to go down to resort airline check-in and give them our checked bags, and then Magical Express will take those to the airport for us, which is nice. Um, otherwise, that's it. We're sad. Man, it's already. We're so sad. Already sore. It goes so fast. I mean, it feels like it's been a nice long trip. Yeah. But the last day always feels like it's gone too yeah. fast. 
What are you gonna do? I know. It stinks. Can't be on holiday forever. No. I am gonna film tomorrow because that'll be our final day slash travel day. Um, but I don't think we're gonna do a whole lot. Right now, we're just pl basically planning on hanging out here, aren't we? Probably. It'll depend we'll on how we feel. Yeah, see yeah, if we get a bee in our bonnets tomorrow and decide we want to chuck on a bus or something to a resort or where Disney Springs, wherever, maybe we will. It'll depend on how we feel. But um, Otherwise, our Magical Express comes at 3.55. Yep. So we have to be on that. And that's it. I'm so sad. Man. I'm looking forward to doing the trip report for this trip, though, because we we did tried a lot of. Whoa, that got very blurry for a second. Um, we did different things. We tried a lot of new things and different things, and especially like the Magical Express and the mouse keeping and the package delivery to the front of the park. We tried a bunch of stuff. So and we talked about oh, it a little yeah, bit at each. About that. Yeah, in each video we talked about it, but it'll be kind of fun to do this trip report for that reason the time of year, crowds, heat, all that kind of stuff. We got lots to say about that. Yeah. Especially after today. Um, yeah, I think we already filmed this, but we went to Hollywood Studios today. We didn't leave till, gosh, we didn't leave here till about 11. Got to Hollywood Studios at 11.30 because I was not feeling good this morning. Um, and I'm still having some issues, but I'm glad we went. We looked at some shops that we hadn't been in before and that was fun. And it's just fun to walk around there. It was fun to ride Slinky Dog. Yeah. Sci-Fi Lunch was amazing. Um, and it was just too hot to stay after that. And then we um, had a super fun Lyft driver that took us to the Yacht Club. Hung out there for a while. Hung out at a beach club for a while. And took a minivan. That was fun, and that driver yeah. was awesome too. Yeah, he was really good. He was really fun, yeah. And then, yeah, that was it. Then we came back here, um, hung out in the room for a little bit, and then we walked back down to landscape, Landscapes of Flavor? Landscape. Landscape of Flavor. Of flavor. And we got some chicken nuggets, because who doesn't love Disney chicken nuggets? Yeah. yeah. And then we uh, spent some more money, because you know, we do. In the store. Yeah, too much. Yeah. And we came back here. Now we've both taken showers and packed up our bags. And we're, right now it looks like we still have, I mean, honestly, even if that luggage scale was off by 10 pounds, we would still be right pretty totally much fine. where we needed to be. Yeah. So we should be just fine there. We're at only like 30 some of a bag. Yeah. So. 33 and 36 a bag. And we're at so, for 50. So. Yeah. So we should be just fine. And then... Hopefully all of our souvenirs will fit in our backpacks. Yeah, that'll be the tough, that'll be the challenge. If they don't, whoa, foggy again, or blurry. If they don't, um, we are allowed a carry-on and a personal item. So I can use my smaller park bag as my personal item and then just we'll just throw the bigger backpack up as a carry-on. Yeah. So I think we'll be just fine. Um, yeah, that's it. We're giving mouse keeping a nice we'll have to big. put all our H2Os in the check bag too. Yes. What, what, stay tuned for our haul because it is going to include so many toiletries. You can't even. I think I'm going to try to film that on Sunday when we get home so that I'll have a video up Friday right away. But let's make a little display at home in our bathroom. Yeah. <laughs> oh, let's look at this when we're sad and missing Disney display. Yeah. But anyway, yeah, last full day, getting ready to go to bed. Somebody's already ducked out. <laughs> Good night. Good night.